Good morning. Well, I've got the beans and they are going in today. Like I was explaining yesterday, there's a bit of a palaver with levels. I think I'm just going to have to do each beam one by one. I think some of them I can notch out. Like I can just take two centimeters out of the bottom of the wood and that'll be fine. Some may be different. Let's just do one at a time and deal with each problem as it comes. Okay, the first one's in without any cutting and it's about, it's about three quarters of a centimetre off, which I think I can deal with over a floor. This span you're not really going to notice. So I'll set this one, I'll set one the other end and then all the ones in between I'll just even out as much as I can as I go. Yeah, we'll just see. So here's how it's working. So I've got my line pinged from one beam to the other. So all I'm doing now, measuring the gap from the beam to the string. And that should, in theory, give me how much to take off of the bottom of each beam. Now I've had a measure along and I think the max I've got to take off so far is about three and a half centimeters. If it gets any more than that, we're gonna have to do something different with them beams, I think. That's kind of the limit I want to take off. Anyway, they're going in.
You know what? It's actually going pretty easy, to be fair. Which is annoying because I was so worried about it yesterday, but yeah, it's like slow work, getting all the measurements right, but once I've got them right, they're just slotting into place. So I haven't got yet to the baddies. Kind of these two at the end, and this one here where you can see where the ironwork's doubled up. They're gonna be more of an issue, but more than this. Okay, last one of today going in. It's the last one mainly because one is getting dark, and two, well, it's the last easy one. The last three are gonna be a pain, so to start a fresh day with them. What a difference though. started putting the noggins in on this side just to kind of keep the space in as I was going along obviously I'm going to do that the whole way yeah three more to get in on this side noggins then get some boards down we've got the other side to do but well I think that's going to be an I-beam situation because to create pockets and stuff with this being a pain already and there was pockets there I think we're going to get another I-beam in here, so that'll, well, I'll order that and that'll be when Nick next comes and we can hopefully use a skid steer again while this room's empty. So chuffed. Anyway, it's a late night and I'll see you tomorrow.